Hey, hey, Og Prep, welcome to another day of drama class. All right, so we're gonna keep on going with our movement exercise, and we're gonna do a little something today that I like to call the playground. And it's pretty simple. All we're gonna do today is think of activities that you would do on a playground and move around as if we were doing them, using just our bodies and big gestures. So, let's think of a couple of things we can do on the playground. I know one thing that we always like to do, um, I know we don't have any dog prep, but if anybody's ever jumped rope before, you could always pretend to do that. So let's pretend that we have the jump rope in our hand, we're sort of shaking it so it gets nice and long, the rope, and let's just go ahead and start, ready? And sometimes we might do little tricks, try to get it out, right, do stuff like that. But pretty simple, we're jumping rope, right? So that's one thing. Another thing we might do on the playground is hopscotch. You've got those little, you know, numbers and squares and everything. Sometimes it's super elaborate. You might just jump, hop on one foot, and then get two feet, right? Sometimes stutter like we did before, but just make sure that your feet are doing the right things you're supposed to do when you do hopscotch, right? And let's see, we've got some other stuff here. See what we got. All right, passing the ball. So let's say you're play, playing baseball with a friend, right? So you got your catcher's mitt here. Do a nice pitch and throw. If you're gonna catch it back, boom, oh, you caught it. Or if you have a basketball, right? You're bouncing it, you pretend we're bouncing that basketball. Taking a nice big shot. Boom, there it goes, right? Or football. You see your buddy way out there, right? Go long. Nice big pass. There we are. That's how it might look like if you pass different balls around at recess. Or soccer, hey, right? Lots of soccer balls, right? So let's say you're going around like this, if you're a goalie maybe, you see the ball coming, and whoa, there's that big weight kick to try and get it, right? And you blocked it, good job. Sometimes you might see it coming and you just head a soccer ball in, bounce it with your head. Several ways we can pretend, right? So just using your bodies, we have no props, no objects, we can pretend that we're doing something. It's pretty easy and it's pretty fun. Let's see what else we got here. I know another one I like a lot is playing in the sandbox, right? So you have a big pile of sand, just taking it and putting it in a pail, right? You just It's fun to fill a pail and then put it down, take it up and whoop, you got a big old sand castle. Digging way underneath, trying to create some tunnels, right? I know I did that all the time when I was a kid. So pretend you got your little shovel, you're taking some sand out, right? And we are playing in the sandbox. Another thing I like to do is swings. Swings are fun, especially that big tire swing. I sure do miss that thing. I know you guys do too, right? So we're sitting on that thing. Somebody's pushing us, whoa. We just pretend nice and easy that we're going super high in a swing and we're hanging on tight. Or if you're pushing the swing, the tire swing, I always tell you guys, two hands on that thing, right? Nice and easy, one two, and three, and that's good enough. You know me, I don't like to go super high. So we push that thing at a safe distance and everybody has a good time. And there's slides too, right? At the top of the slide, we're sitting down, doing the right thing. Sometimes we put our hands up and woo, off we go. So there are many different ways that you can take gestures and movement and act like you're doing your favorite activities on the playground. I'll tell you the truth. This is probably one of the hardest things for me to do because I sure miss seeing you guys out there. We always had so much fun at recess. But once we come back, that's one of the first things we'll do. We'll reacquaint ourselves with things to do on the playground. All right, my friends, that's all I've got for today. Until next time, drum on.